Hey, what's up everybody? Johnny here from Manito.com. So if you recall, I recently made a review video of the Revolut Metal Plan, which if you haven't seen yet, I'll link below in the description box. Well, while I was making that video, I thought the plan sounded really cool and beneficial for me. So I decided to sign up. And yesterday I received my shiny steel and gold Revolut Metal card. So this is the gold Revolut metal card. As I said, it's made from steel and it has this polished finish, which is a result of pink particles that are layered onto the card during manufacturing. And in the right light, you can actually see those particles and they give the card a pretty cool and unique look and feel. Revolut, Visa Infinite and your name are all cut out precisely using a diamond drill and that makes the card look super clean. The Visa logo also has these tiny minute ridges and that's just unique to the Visa logo. And on the back you have the magnetic stripe and your card details, the signature strip as well, and the Dove hologram that kind of catches and reflects the light beautifully. I also like how the back feels it has a smoother texture and coating while the front has this sort of polished and dusty feel. It does have a trash can icon on the back, which I'm slightly confused by. Like maybe someone in the comments can clarify what that means. But to me, it just looks like a trash bin that's being crossed out. Now, this is my wallet that I'm carrying right now. It's by Aspinall of London. And I just carry a couple of cards and an Apple AirTag. And the cards I'm carrying at the moment are my Starling debit card and my Wise multi currency card, and also now my Revolut metal gold card, which fits really nicely into my card holder. It's the normal same size of a card, and it's really not much thicker, although it does weigh actually a lot more than my Wise card, over three times the amount, in fact. And the only thing I'm really concerned about when it comes to this card is like, how much is it gonna wear? It's really fresh right now, but with regular use, like, will it get scratched? I did gently scratch it with my finger and it seems pretty resilient, but it'll be interesting to see how the card looks in like three months after it's had some regular use. So to fully activate this card, you just have to make a pin payment. However, you can immediately start spending online using a virtual debit card. But what's cool is you don't need to do anything to activate it on your phone and it works straight out of the packaging, which by the way, isn't nearly as impressive as the card itself, especially compared to previous Revolut unboxing experiences that I've had. So this is the metal packaging, and I actually, when I got my first Revolut card, received this thing. <laughs> it's way more intriguing and unique to me though than what the Revolut metal card arrived in. Now, if you want to freeze or stop the card, it's really easy to do this via the Revolut app. So if you lose it or perhaps it's stolen, you can just quickly put it on hold. The app also has this function where you can add the card to Amazon, which to me seems like a bit of a gimmick because you could just save your card details yourself. In app, you can also track the delivery of your card, which by the way, was impressively fast. I think it only took 48 hours to arrive after I registered for Metal. The app also allows you to set spending limits as well as label the card virtually and order a replacement if you need it. And if you do end up needing to replace the card, you get one free replacement and after that it's 40 pounds per card. Of course, you can add this card to your Apple Wallet or Google Pay and also your Apple Watch if you want. And if you do all of this, you'll receive instant notifications when you spend money. And if you decide to put the card on hold, you'll also be notified that your card is no longer working. It really is, at the end of the day, just a card made of steel. It's pretty important to remember that beyond the social credit that you may receive or be after from having this card, it doesn't really hold any benefits. But I have personally been benefiting from the cashback rewards and the app will show you the cashback that you have available, including this handy nearby reward section that will tell you what stores or shops are nearby where you can earn cashback. But right now I can earn 3% with Amazon and 5% at John Lewis, which by the way is 
pretty handy if you're buying expensive goods like furniture. Ultimately for me though, the deal breaker for getting the metal plan wasn't this card. It was the other benefits like the cashback. But if you're not concerned by cashback, as I mentioned in my review video, the Revolut premium plan, which is half the price and has similar benefits to metal, might be the better choice. If you think you'll benefit from metal or you just like the flex of having the metal card, then it's definitely worthwhile. People always look twice when you get it out to pay for something, which isn't necessarily what I want from a card, but it can be quite a good conversation starter. Anyway, thanks for watching today's video. Bit of a quick one, but I just wanted to share with you the card. And also, since I've now registered for Metal, I'll likely do a review in a couple of months and update you on how it's going and if it's been beneficial. So make sure you subscribe to the channel for that video. And if you do want to get Revolut Metal, click the link in the description box. It's an affiliate link, so you'll be supporting Manito if you use it. I'll see you on the next video. Thanks for watching. Goodbye.